Hello everyone, Collectors Den, Steve, Dennis. We just got in a box from uh, Zagorne and uh, we figured we'd show you what we got in. Some really interesting masks, starting with this one here. Uh, they call it the uh, Kick-Ass Beast. Nice part is the fact that the uh, mouth moves as your mouth moves. You know, this just hooks under your chin got a mount so it rests nicely on your head. Uh, the detail is tremendous. It's really, really great looking. It is. I think it's probably one of their uh, one of their best that I've seen yet. But I, you know, it, it, it'll work nicely. And plenty of room in the eye holes to see out. Has the ventilation and everything needed. It's a really Overall, I'd say it's a great mask. They've got a whole mixture of different types of monster masks this year because they're really well known for their facial masks. Those were the big thing. Yeah, we saw them on a trans wall. Yeah, definitely. And this one is the uh, uh, Teddy the Troll. <laughs> it's... It, it's crazy looking. The mouth doesn't move. The eye holes are cut. Big nose, horns, fur in the back, you know, so it fits nicely as a full mask. Great looking detail. Again, Teddy the Troll, really, really nice. This one, this one is actually set up in the old style. <laughs> Uh, mask, I'd say almost like the uh, Don Post type masks, hmm. uh, in the sense that it has the long extension in the back to drape over. It does have Velcro if you want to put the two pieces together. Oops, excuse me. <laughs> there it is. If you want to put the two pieces around in front like that. Also, It has the strap inside, so you just strap it on and then just flip the head stuff over. If you want to pull it around in the front, you can. Overall, a very, very nice mask. Nice, simple, very comfortable. The Rogue. All right, the next mask from Zagorny is called the, uh, the Cheshire Cat. It's done the same style. It's got the opening in the back here. So that it just slides right over your head. Large opening for the eyes so you can see out nice and clear. Nice little ears like setup. An interesting demon, if nothing else. There is a, there's a wild looking demon. They do have the eyes up above and then you can see outside, you see underneath here. Great detail. All, all the masks seem to have really great detail this year. They really put a lot of effort into this. And like I said, very, very simple mask for them. It just drops over without any trouble. Definitely think it's uh, gonna be a big hit this year, all, the, all of their masks. For a change of pace, we have the skeleton. Now the skeleton here, uh, is, what's great about it is the fact that it's uh, reactive to uh, black light. It's really cool. Yeah, mouth is set up so that it, it moves and it has an inner, the sock is inside so you can't see your mouth at all. And like I said, it's just a simple setup sock with an elastic. So you just put it on, it's like putting a sock over your head but a tremendous, tremendous, nice detail again. Very, very nice. This next mask is unique because they're giving you both the hood and the sock. You slide the sock over your head, arrange the hood. And this one's called, what did I say, the vulture? Yeah. Yeah, this is the vulture. Again, mouth moves is yours. Really, really nice. Excellent detail. You're looking for a, an interesting alien type setup or, uh, you know, 
get yourself a, a robe and put this on. It could be some kind of demon. But sure. nice, nice detail. I like the colors. It's a different. They, they came out with the purple looking. I think it's really, really nice. Nice setup. Really, really nice. I like the gold in there and all. Very nice one. The Vulture. As I've said a lot about Zagorny, the, uh, they, they do love their old man masks. And this is their new one for this year. <laughs> uh, <laughs> it's definitely unique. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's not, I guess he's, you know, it sort of fits. Runny nose. Someone's called snot your problem. Yeah. Definitely interesting in the setup though. You know, you have the mouth that moves and you get a, you get a nice cap with it. And you can put, put your own uh, information on the cap if you want. It's something cool, you know, if you want to do something old look, looking, you want to do an old man or something like that, it's a tremendous piece. Again, this is, uh, it's, not your, it's not your problem. <laughs> I like to know who comes up with the names. This one's Death. Again, mouth moves as yours does. Uh, it has a, the black for the sock inside. Great detail, you can see out the eyes. Like I said, it is a sock setup. It's set knit in the back with elastic so that you know it'll expand as you put it on. And some really nice, nice detail to it and all. So, really. <laughs> I guess I guess they decided they needed multi-colored uh, skulls. Yeah. All right, here's something new for them. <laughs> uh, they wanted to try to get into some of the animal masks, so they made a rainbow unicorn cat, and that's just called unicorn cat. There you go. Very very nice piece. Mouth is not open. It does have a slit for breathing. Eyes holes are here, very easy to see out of. Again, it's a full design elastic in the back, stretches so you while you put it on. Very cute for both the young and the old alike. Unicorn cat. Another version of the same. He's called Unicorn Cat. <laughs> Done in the in the black and gold set up. Again, you can see the eye holes are nice and large. You can see out venting for your breathing. Again, elastic in the back to stretch when you put it on. Well, lots of glitter. I tell you, those two had a lot of glitter on them. Mm -hmm. <laughs> very, very cute piece for the young and the old alike. Here's a great winner for you. Miles of Smiles. Uh, <laughs> there's there's a guy definitely <laughs> a lot of teeth. <laughs> Great detailing in here. I like the the staining on the teeth, the jaw in the back. Now this doesn't move, of course, when your jaw does, but it's again lovely. It's got the big eye holes. Nice in the back, just slides right over. Really, really nice piece. Really nice something different that's for sure okay our next one from Sigourney is a uh, moonstruck wolf it's you can see the mouth mechanism it's hooked to yours so when you open your mouth the mouth moves with it excellent detailing he's snarling hair is it's really really nice it's soft you can fluff it up or do whatever you want with it very, very nice looking mask. Again, easy to put on. It just slides right on. It's one thing about Sigourney masks, they're very easy to put on and they're extremely comfortable. Very, very nice. 
they had the same guy set up in, in a white called Ghost Wolf. Again, the same thing. The mouth moves as yours does. Beautiful hair, excellent detail. It's basically like a grayish white combination. You know, different type, but it, again, really, really nice. They also have the full kits for these if you're interested in getting the whole costume. Very, very nice looking piece. Steven even liked this one when he saw it. He thought it was tremendous the way it was done. Definitely. The bird. What is this one? Ravenous. What? Ravenous. Ravenous. Oh, my goodness. Ooh, Again, goodness. it's set up so it works off your jaw. It, you want to be a, a bird, man. <laughs> And again, same thing, jaw moves. It actually has glass eyes here so that you're able to uh, see out. I think they're tinted basically. It's hard to see, you know, your finger, but it, they are tinted. Again, a sock set up to pull it over your head. And uh, very, very cool looking. You can just push the hair out of the way and you have Ravenous Birdman. It's a uh, evil clown with a sock hat. That's what holds it on, in fact, is the, the beanie. The beanie. But the, uh, you know, mouth moves as yours does in the lower and upper lower. It's like a demon clown. <laughs> like that. It's, it's a mixture of just about everything. Uh, what this called? Uh, cryptic clown. Yeah, cryptic clown. Okay, cryptic clown. There you go. Nice detail, though. I love the hair. They did a really, really. This year they've done a great job with the uh, uh, wash effect and and the airbrushing and everything. Really, really, really nice. And like I said, it's held on. By the beanie. Another sock demon. Same thing, movable, movable jaw for underneath. <laughs> a lot of teeth. They must have they must have had a big thing about teeth this year. A lot, a lot, a lot of teeth. Again, nice sock setup. <laughs> this guy, unfortunately, we lost his tag. Oh no. Yeah, his tag's missing. Oh, well, I'll have to go and we'll just call him the demon for now. <laughs> but the eye holes are here, nice, clear. I like this bone. It's basically a mixture of a bone blackish, uh, white. They got some browns in there, then red around the eyes and then around the gums. They sprayed a little light touch of red in there to give you a nice, you know, effect. Ah, yep. Mm -hmm. Great effect. Great, great effect. All right, the last one. Last year they did uh, something similar to this. It was the Ringmaster. Uh, this year, um, where is his name? Oh, again, the Ringmaster. Modifications. I think it's got a lot more detail. It's a bigger face setup. Uh, I think the mustache and the... Uh, the coloring and everything is excellent. You got the hair. The hat is basically, it, there's a underlying uh, connection. You just strap it around your head and then the hat just sits down on top. Great, great, great effect. I love the, the mouth moves as yours. Tremendous, tremendous, tremendous. Beautiful. To me, this is one of their uh, the top pieces. Very, very cool. You could do them as just about anything, what, whatever you want to do. You can dress them up as a ringmaster or just, you know, as, as an undertaker or a graveyard ghoul, whatever you want to do with them. Tremendous, tremendous, tremendous piece. Anyway, that's it.
This is uh, the new, I would say the new masks. I haven't gotten anything else in yet. If we do, of course, we'll let you see them. But Zagorne, I think, hit it out of the park this time. It's really, really good pieces. Uh, the, like I said, they're well known for their old people masks, which they still have a lot of. But these are all the new things for this year. And I think they're going to do real, real well expanding their market. So we wish them all the best. Anyway, I'm Dennis. This is Steve. I hope you enjoyed the uh, video. Uh, you know, if you'd be kind enough to, you know, give us a thumbs up if you like it. Hit the, uh, the, uh, um, hit the, hit the like, hit, yeah, comment, hit the, like. the bell, subscribe, all that stuff. Yep. We'd appreciate it. Thank you very much. Have a good day.